buying a core burn rocket tool set can sometimes seem a little bit overwhelming. There are a number of different options that are available. At Firesmith Manufacturing, we produce three different core burn rocket tool sets in three sizes, one pound, three pound, and six pound sizes. These tool sets can all be used to make black powder motors, whistle motors, strobe motors, and color changing motors, but there are some subtle differences between our three different tool sets that might make one particular set a little bit more appealing for your application than the others. We've got our Super BP Core Burn Tool Set, our Universal Core Burn Tool Set, and our Nozzleless Core Burn Tool Set. So let's go ahead and explore the differences between these three different tool sets to help you decide on which one is the best for you. Our Super BP Core Burn Tool Set and our Universal Core Burn Tool Set do look a lot alike, and there are quite a few similarities. If you put them side by side, you'll notice that they both have geometry down at the base of the spindle to form the divergent nozzle. Both sets of number one rammers also have the geometry at the base to form the convergent nozzle. So basically, as we're compacting clay around the base of the spindle, we're going to form a funnel to direct those exhaust gases through the throat of the nozzle, and then another funnel to help those exhaust gases expand once they go through the nozzle opening, and that's going to create thrust. However, looking at these two, there are some differences. You'll notice that our Super BP Core Burn Tool Set is a little bit taller and skinnier than our Universal Core Burn Tool Set. The uh, nozzle opening on our Super BP Core Burn Tool Set is also slightly smaller in diameter than the nozzle opening on our Universal Core Burn Tool Set. In practice, the differences between these tool sets really only apply to making black powder motors with a clay nozzle. With the two Super BP Core Burn Tool Set, you're going to want to use a 60-30-10 black powder as your fuel. And again, that's going to be 60 parts potassium nitrate, 30 parts charcoal, 10 parts sulfur. Whereas with the uh, Universal Core Burn Tool Set, because we've got a slightly shorter spindle and a larger diameter nozzle opening, we can use a faster burning black powder with a clay nozzle. So with this particular tool set, you can use a 75-15-10 black powder with a clay nozzle to make your rocket fuel. And again, that's 75 parts potassium nitrate, 15 parts charcoal, and 10 parts sulfur. Outside of that, if we're going to be making benzoate whistles or strobe motors or color changing motors, either of these tool sets are almost interchangeable. You can produce very similarly performing motors with those particular tool sets. Our nozzleless core burn tool set, you'll notice though, doesn't have the geometry at the base to uh, form our divergent nozzle, and we don't have the geometry on our number one rammer to form the convergent nozzle. So this particular tool set is set up for those people that like to make a lot of whistle motors, a lot of strobe motors, or motors uh, using black powder fuel without a clay nozzle. It really is personal preference, depending upon which set you want to go with, but they can all produce similar motors. It's just depending upon which one fits your application better than the others.